live. Yeah, hi. I saw your advertisement on the uh, Craig's of Listing. How are you doing today, sir? Uh, how are you doing today? I'm great. I uh, I noticed you, you have the husband for hire ad- advertisement up. Is that correct? Yeah. Okay. I noticed that you said that uh, your wife is also available as part of the team. Is that correct? Well, actually, uh, she might want to do some work or something, but I've got a job now. But her and her sister are looking for work. Oh, and they both look good. that that'd yeah. be that'd be great. Um, if you could get all three, that'd be ideal, actually. Well, I'm I'm not going to quit my job. I've got a really good job. Okay, well, I don't need you to quit or anything. It, it, it'd probably be just a one-time job. Oh, okay. Well, uh, what exactly do you need done, Captain? Uh, well, it was initially I, I kind of had like a four-person project in mind, but if you wanted to get your wife and her sister involved, it could be a five-person project. I'd be open to that. It's just that. Uh, my wife Janet and I were actually looking to uh, get a couple people involved in a project of ours, and I know you have separate tools in a truck, but neither of which will really be necessary. There, there may be a particular tool of yours that my wife might be interested in to put in her fanny pack. Do I have what? Uh, I said for her fanny pack. Um, I'm gonna tell you what. Best thing you can do is probably call this afternoon and talk to my wife about this. She stays pretty busy, but uh, I know she would like to have some more. So why don't you call back and talk with her? Okay. Well, I don't want to. The thing is, I could probably call some other swingers on Craigslist. So I was wondering if I could, could I call her cell phone, maybe? No, huh? No, she's driving, man, and I don't. You know, that's that's a little bit dangerous. Okay. Well, what's her number? I'll give her a call later on. Then I won't call right yeah, now. Just this the same phone number. Okay, what about your wife's sister? Could I possibly reach out to her for some work? Uh, same number. Okay, so you guys just alternate the same phone? Well, she's got a house beside ours, and we just let her move in. So. Yeah, yeah, I understand. Okay, well, what's the wife's number? I'll just give her a call. I'll tell you what. Don't call back, okay? What? What? I'm Bye. sorry? Uh, hello? Did I fuck it up? <laughs> Hi. Yeah, hi. I think the phone got disconnected What's a second. What's your number? What's your number? Well, I, I, you were just about What's your to give... phone number? What's your wife's phone number? Yeah, you were you were just about to give me her phone number, I think, and I, the phone got disconnected listen, somehow. Listen, just uh, call somebody else, okay? But you're you look like the most enticing husband for hire team with the wife and the sister involved. It seems like you let me the tell you something. Fit. Don't call this number again, okay? Okay. Hypothetically speaking, just throwing this out there, if I was to call back. Would that don't. be a problem? Don't call back here. Okay. Well, the thing is, I, I okay. just, I, I kind of wanted to get like a foursome or fivesome involved. If, if the, the. Oh, I'll tell you what. Don't call back here now. If you want to give me your number or your address, I'll come out there and we'll talk together. Okay. How yeah. about that? That'd What's your address? That'd be great. If you want to do like an in per, in person type of meetup, that'd be awesome. Actually, I think that would kind of expedite things and really take this in the right direction. What's your address? All right, my address is uh, 429. Okay. W- 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 what time are we setting this up for? Just just give me the rest of the address, and we'll talk about that in a minute. Okay, so are, are you going to be coming over here, though, or, or what's the deal? 429 what? Okay, 429. Go ahead. It's East Martin Luther King Jr. Boulevard. Hello. <laughs> he hung up after getting the address. Uh oh, he's coming to get me. Hello. Uh, hello. Yes. Hey, Linda. How you doing? I'm good. How are you? I'm great. Um, uh, I just I was calling. I was speaking to your husband earlier about the uh, the, the work for hire, and uh, uh-huh. he was asking me to give give you a call back later. Does he happen to be there? Yeah, he is. Okay. Did he Did he tell you anything about me? No. Oh, okay. All right. Well, yeah, we... What uh, kind of work did you have? Basically, I have kind of a four-person project, and I wanted to get you two involved. Your your husband was, was mentioning to me that your sister's also available? Yeah. Okay. I mean, that would be, like, definitely not what I expected, but that'd be really, really interesting if we can get her involved as well. And what is the hourly rate for all five of you? All, all the three of you, sorry. Well, what kind of work is it that you're wanting us to do? Oh, okay. Well, see, 
it's, it's kind of interesting. My wife Janet and I, uh, we, we we wanted just some 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 company and people to spend some time with. Okay, we're not prostitutes. We are hard manual laborers. You need to call somebody else. And if you call back here again, I can trace your number and buddy, I'm gonna come hunt your ass down. Bertha, don't call back here. Then we'll read the entire ad. Bertha, I didn't even finish my sentence. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> this one just turned into a really good one. <laughs> Hello? Uh, yeah, hey, I, I think we got disconnected. I wasn't sure. I think there might have been a misunderstanding. Hey, let, let me explain something. We don't eat coochie. We don't give blowjobs. We do yard work. We do not swap. We explain this to you. My daughter's a deputy sheriff, and I, we, we don't do that, okay? Yeah, we do yard work and stuff like that. We don't eat coochie, and we don't do wee wee. So you got the wrong I one. I need a to talk call to back. Uh, hello. Thank you, and have a wonderful hello. day. God bless uh, you. Hello. <laughs> I was trying to go all Billy on her, but she wouldn't even give me a chance. <laughs> well, you guys heard the lady. She don't eat coochie, and she don't do wee-wees. <laughs> so don't get your hopes up. If you enjoyed the prank, let me know by clicking that like button down below. And make sure you check out my last video where I called a Walmart pretending that I was allowed to purchase GTA 5 early. And then the conversation spirals out of control somehow and gets ridiculous, especially in part two. Anyways, thank you for watching, and until next time, toodles! Alright, I feel you alright, so what time you wanna come over today and play some co-op? <laughs>